had a good question today about how to add a word search puzzle into Articulate Presenter. And although there isn't a built-in feature for something like this in the Articulate Studio products, what you can do is use an online tool to build your own puzzle and then add that as a web object in Presenter. And that's what we've got right here. This one's pretty simple. It's got just a few words over here in the word list. And um, you can see I've found one word already, so that one's already crossed out. And to find the next word, you just click and drag and then release. And you get a little bit of feedback. Um, the score changes. There's some audible feedback. And then that word gets crossed off of the list. Now, this isn't scorable or trackable um, because it's really just an HTML file that's embedded in your presentation. So even though it appears in your course, uh, it's really kind of independent. So the results can't really be tracked or recorded but it might be a nice way to create a review activity or something like that. So there are a number of different sites that you could use to build your game. Really any site that allows you to build a puzzle and get the embed code for it should work. Um, the one that I used is one called Pro Profs Games. And it looks like this and it's free and you can um, create a login on the site and that'll enable you to create um, as many games as you want. So to create a word search, what you can do is click on create a game and when this next page pops up, there's this word search game right here, and we'll click Create Game. And uh, this is where we can uh, enter our words. And I've got um, several that I've already pasted to my clipboard, so I'll go ahead and paste those in. And I think that there's a minimum of uh, three words, so you need to have at least uh, three terms that you put in there. And once you've gotten your terms in there, you can click Create My Game. And then you'll also need to enter a few more items. The game title, this isn't actually something that appears in the game, but um, it's used because this is kind of a social site where other people can um, find your games and link to them and use the embed code and things like that. So that's why um, that's why we need to enter some stuff here. And same for the tags. You know, if somebody is searching for a particular topic, this might be helpful to them if they want to check out your game and maybe use it in um, in their website or their course. And then for difficulty, you can choose what you want here, and you can also select you know, how much time you want to give your learners to complete the game, and then just click Save My Game. And then the next page that pops up, um, we'll be able to click Play Game, and it's going to show us what that game will look like. And of course, we could play the game right here if we wanted to, but we don't want to do that. What we want to do is grab the embed code, which is this little green link right here. So I'm going to click on that takes us down here to the bottom and then we can click in this um, embed code field and then do a control C and um, once you've copied the embed code to your clipboard what you can do is open up a blank file in notepad and this is where we're going to create just a very simple HTML page and you can see how I've done it here there's just an opening HTML tag an opening body tag and then um, similarly at the end the um, tags that close that and then in the middle of those two is where we want to paste that embed code so we'll go ahead and paste it and uh, that's all we need to do now we're going to save it and here's the important part you need to save it in its own folder on your hard drive and what we want to do is do a save as and call it index.html and you'll also need to change this um, file type here to all files and I've, I'd already saved one previously by this name, I'm just going to save right over it. That'll be fine. And so that part is done. And now we can switch over to Articulate Presenter and add it to our course. So what we want to do is on the Articulate menu, we want to choose Web Object. And this is where we select that folder. So we'll click on the folder icon, and then we'll find the folder that we created that contains that index.html that we just made, and then click OK and then click OK again. And this is going to insert the web object and it's going to be pretty big so you can size it down and you might need to do a little bit of trial and error to uh, see how it's going to look on your slide. Um, I kind of designed this ahead of time and I know that it's going to fit pretty well right in here so we'll go ahead and preview this and we'll see how it will look. So the game will load and then it shows up like this and then your learners can complete it. Now one thing I also want to mention is if you don't want these two little links down here at the bottom, you can change your embed code. So what you'll want to do here is just uh, select right here at the beginning, or I guess it's at the end really, the closing div tag, and then just select all the way up to where it says div style, the first um, bracket before that, and then you can just get rid of that whole thing and then resave um, your index.html file and then if you insert that as your web object, then these two little links down here won't appear. So that's a way that you can incorporate a word search puzzle into your Articulate Presenter course.